Um, <clears throat> shall I show Eileen over to the um, to the other candidates? Yeah, yeah. Sure. You second up, Eileen. Now, we'll put a good word in for me. No need. You? you got this all sewn up. <laughs> See what I did there. Come through, Alina. Eileen, uh, what you doing here? Uh, hey. Um. <laughs> So, Seb said that he'd seen you, but he didn't know if you were staying. There was no work at home. A friend got me a job in a bar here, and I saw this, and I thought, why not? Is it safe for you? Well, all the people in that gang are in prison now. Yeah, thank goodness. And I made sure that bar job was a real one. <laughs> you gonna see Seb? No. I heard he was engaged, so... From Amy? Yeah. Yeah, I think she's got her wires crossed. You mean he's not with Emma? With Emma, yeah, but um, engaged. Hey, guys, I'm sorry. We're running a bit late. So if you want to just help yourselves to coffee, oh, and just to warn you, so today I'm going to be playing an angry customer, so it's going to be your job to get me on side. How are your diplomatic skills? Mm. In Romanian, not so bad. In English? Mm. Mm. Oh, that makes us even, then. <laughs> but I made the order two weeks ago. Yeah, and we're getting on with it as fast as we can, madam. I'm afraid that's not good enough. Well, there's nothing else I can do, madam. Well, do you know that I've still not been reimbursed for the order with the moth holes? I remember that. Um, moth holes. Moths. Flying insects. Yeah, I know what moths are. Thanks very much. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I irritating you? Well, it's the accounts department you need to speak to. Yes, but it's you that I'm talking to. I'll give him a nudge. It needs to be more I'm than... I'm going to nudge you. Wow, they said you had a temper. Who did? I've heard people use rival taxi firms to avoid talking to you. Is this for real, or are you... Said just... you're famous for it. Stuff them. Anyway, it's production who deals with knickers. It's negligence. Oh, whatever. Just don't shoot the messenger. Right. Thanks, Eileen. I think we'll, we'll leave it there. Right. Made a pig's ear of that, didn't I? Do you really let your customers speak to you like that? That's nothing. Um, could you send Alina in for me, please? Do you honestly expect my customers to buy that rubbish? This is terrible. 500 pairs have ordered. Well, first of all, my apologies. Return them to us and we will get you a new delivery as soon as possible. Well, I don't know if I want them if they're going to be like that. They won't be, I assure you. And you will get a discount with your next order. Oh, OK, how much? That's something your finance team can talk about with our manager. But we value your business and we will do all we can to keep it. Have you done this kind of work before? No. Do you fancy a curry later? As long as it's with you. <laughs> oh, you look smart. Oh. Been for an interview at uh, Underworld Customer Services. Did you get it? Well, I very much doubt it. Still, if I amused Sarah. <laughs> Alina? Yeah, I was going to tell you, a friend of yours is up for the same job as me. I, I um... I, I, I heard you were back a while ago. I didn't know if you were if you were sticking around or what. I've been staying with a friend. Oh, Lena, um, so you come in. Oh, so when do I start? Oh. Well... Look, I'm going to have to give a notice at Street because I'm thinking maybe what, a week after. Eileen, I'm sorry. Oh, give over. I'm joking with you. I know I've not got it. Well, you were very close. No, I was not. So come on, has she got it? Well, I don't know if you still want the job. I would love it. Sorry, Eileen. Well, just don't tell Tim and Steve that I applied for it. <laughs> so can you start tomorrow? That would be fantastic. OK, <laughs> cool. I'll brief you properly then, so. <laughs> really happy for you, seriously. Thank you. I hope you don't mind me doing this. No. No, of course not. Congratulations. Thank you. This is my, um, this is my, this is my girlfriend, Emma. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. 